Hey there, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install a MetaTrader 4 EA or an expert advisor, sometimes known as a trading robot if it places trades for you. So what we're going to do here is you're going to first download the EA from a vendor. Uh, it could be from our store. It could be from another vendor. It could be from the MetaTrader 4 code base. Wherever you get it, doesn't matter. Just download that into a folder where you can find it and it will look something like this. Now it could be in either two formats. It could be in EX4 or it could be in MQ4. And the difference is that the MQ4 is just a source file. So you can go in there and you can make edits to it using the free editor inside of MetaTrader 4. Um, and if you need to make changes to it or set alerts or whatever you want to do, you can change that code. Um, the EX4 file is the compiled version. So once it's compiled, you can't make any edits to it. But either one is fine. If you put that into the folder that I show you here in this video, MetaTrader will automatically convert it to an EX4 file so it can read that. Or if you have the EX4 file already, you'll just add that in. Now, some vendors will send you a file in zip format. So all you want to do here is double click on that and then extract all. And then choose the place that you want to extract it to and click extract. And then you'll have a file that looks like this, one of these files. Some people try to double click on the file and they say, oh, nothing happens. Uh, that's because it's not going to automatically install for you. You have to install this manually. So here's how you do it. So go over to MetaTrader. Uh, you want to open the navigator. So that's this button here with the star and the folder on it. Uh, you can also do a control N or you can do view and then use the or hit the navigator there and that will hide it and then you can uh, show it again. So that will show you all of the indicators, um, expert advisors and scripts that you have. So in this case, you want to expand the expert advisors folder and you can see all the expert advisors that are currently installed. Before you go ahead and install the expert advisor, you want to make sure that auto trading is on. So when auto trading is on, that will allow the expert advisor to run. So if it's off, it will be red. If it's on, it's green. So just make sure that's on before you get started. Then go to file, open data folder. And this will give you the data folder um, that you're going to put the EA file into. Now, as you can see from this um, breadcrumb trail here, uh, it's not really obvious where the folder is. So be sure to use the open data folder inside of MedTrader 4. Otherwise, it's going to be hard to get to if you just use a uh, file navigator like this. So from here, go to MQL4, Experts, and then you're going to take your file. So let's just take the uh, EX4 file since it's already here. We're going to drop that into the folder, and now it's installed. So we're going to close this up. We're going to restart MetaTrader 4 because it won't recognize the um, EA because as you can see here on the list, uh, the moving average EA is not in there yet. So we're going to have to restart MetaTrader 4. And once MetaTrader 4 is restarted, you'll see the new expert advisor appear on the list. So from there, all you do is you take the expert advisor, drag it onto the chart, and it's going to give you uh, this dialog box. Now, you want to pay attention to the inputs tab on the top here because this is going to give you your settings and if you have a paid ea this is usually where they put the input field for the license key so there's going to be a field called something like license key you just double click here you paste in your license key and then you click ok and that will activate the ea now some eas won't have an activation key so you don't have to worry about it but it just depends on the ea that you have installed so once you've set it up here then go to ok and in the upper right corner of your chart, you will see the name of the EA and a smiley face. And that shows that the EA is now active and working on your chart. Now, if you want to remove the EA, just right click on the chart, go to expert advisors and remove. And you'll see that the name of the expert advisor in the upper right corner is going to be gone. So that's all there is to it. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you want to get more videos like this, subscribe, hit the bell to get notifications. And thanks for watching.